Suds drainage systems are an increasingly important part of stormwater control. In addition to conventional pipe networks, Stormscape can design grassed swales and storage ponds. Returning to the DDS tab, a project will be launched to design a swale and pond arrangement. Having launched a project, the user completes the project-related details as previously. The location and rainfall data can then be selected for the design. Having uploaded the background drawing, the user then selects the Add Pond Contour button and traces around the top level of the pond. The information relating to the pond is then entered within the pond data box located to the right of the design window. Contours within the area of the pond are progressively added, extending down to the effective base level. The user has the opportunity to construct islands within the pond. This can be done as each layer of the pond is defined. The user then establishes the outfall arrangement in relation to level and required flow. The appropriate inlet detail is added to the pond, in this example a connecting swale. The swale is added using the Add Swale tool, and by clicking along the root of the swale, which can be either free-formed or loaded on the background drawing. By clicking on the Add Swale tool, the associated swale data box appears to the right of the design window, where the user selects between a dry or wet swale option, adds the drainage area, either pre-measured or by using the Add Area tool.
The preferred depth of the swale and the bed width are then entered. Together with the value of roughness, based on the height of vegetation within the channel and the design bank slope. The overall gradient of the swale is defined by the bank level at the head of the system and the inflow level at the point of discharge into the pond. By pressing the calculation button, the user obtains the design parameters for the swale, together with the graphic below the design window. The user returns to the pond by clicking on the upper layer and then selects the Calculate button below the design panel to review the relevant rainfall and volumetric data for the design in question. Provided the pond parameters meet your requirements, then your pond design is now complete.